Let's add 5 eighths and 5 sixteenths. Here's how you do it. What we want to do is get this denominator here to be the same. We want a common denominator. Because if these are the same, we add the numerators, bring the denominator across, and we're done. So let's do this. Let's say 2 times 8. That would equal 16. We have 16 over here. But we can't just multiply the denominator by a number. We need to multiply the numerator by the same number as well. Here, 2 over 2. And 2 over 2, that's just 1. So we're multiplying by 1. Don't change the value, just how it's represented. 2 times 5, that is 10. 2 times 8 is 16. And 10 sixteenths is an equivalent fraction to 5 eighths. They have the same value. Now we add our 5 sixteenths here. And because we have the same denominator, we're going to add those numerators. 10 plus 5 is 15. And then we bring the denominator across. 16. So 5 eighths plus 5 sixteenths, that equals 15 sixteenths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.